So I got Shauna the She-Devil, and I thought you guys might like to see this card uh, in action, given that it's a prohibitively expensive Series 5 card. I know most people aren't going to get to play with this one, but might want to see how well Shauna works. And I uh, finally found a deck I like for Shauna. I've actually been trying for a few days. We've tried Shauna in so many different archetypes. We tried Zoo for Shauna, like a traditional Zoo deck. We tried sarah stuff for sarah miracle decks we we tried uh zabu lists of course just tossing her in zabu decks we even tried some like more strict lockdown decks this one's kind of a lockdown zoo i would say for for shauna a bit of more of a hybrid and this is the first one that actually worked pretty well we also just took a look at some other deck lists they didn't have great data uh low like 40 percent win rates but this one was able to go 50 50 that's some really big streaks too and i think we would have gone fairly positive on cubes if I weren't streaming with this one, taking some big losses on stream just to see the endings. So right now, this feels like the most promising Shauna list for me. But of course, we went 50-50. This is nothing to write home about. This is not some crazy high win rate deck. It just looks promising with refinements, with somebody spending a lot of time improving this, certain meta pockets. You might be able to succeed a little more with Shauna. And I think we're going to have some future cards coming in to support Shauna too, like Dazzler. So for now... This felt like the best option we had for Shauna. And the way this deck works is it's kind of a control lockdown shell where you're limiting your opponent's plays. You're disrupting your opponent a little bit. You're locking out a location with a card like Storm and then using things like Shauna to dump power into that location later, particularly when combined with buffs from Kazar and Blue Marvel. You've got all of these things that are kind of limiting your opponent, but you're still able to put a lot of power into play and do so asymmetrically with things like Debris and Shauna going really wide and then supporting that with your buff cards. If you think about it right, Shauna is often summoning kind of three two power units for you, which makes her about a four eight on average. Sometimes there's high rolls, of course, with Ebony Maw, and there aren't really too many low rolls. There's like the hood basically. Uh, and then if you're getting, you know, each of those buffed by two additional power off your Kazar and Blue Marvel, it's kind of like Shauna summoning, you know, 16 power on average, which for a four cost card's really good and can really help split your stats nicely for things like Doctor Doom follow-ups later as well. So all in all, you'll be surprised just how often Shauna can add some sneaky good stats to somewhere else they weren't available or also just dump a lot of stuff into play. So you're going to see some Shauna wins, you're going to see some Shauna losses, and you're going to see some Shauna shenanigans in this video. So enjoy. Oh, and real quick before I get started, a lot of people are going to ask about the deck tracker I'm using in this video because it's brand new. This one comes from untapped.gg. It'll basically live track which cards are, uh, you know, already in hand or which ones are still in deck, which can make it nice. Like, hmm, what are my chances of top decking uh, exactly, Doctor Doom, and you'll you'll be able to tell. It also will show you which cards have been destroyed and discarded. If you click these, there's none now because I'm not in the game, but it'll show you that's a car hits early and you missed what got discarded. This will track it for you. So this can be a really handy little tool if you're playing on PC. I've got a link down in the description below if you want to grab the uh, the deck tracker here featured in the video. Shauna is your wife? That's crazy. She's my wife too. <laughs> I'm gonna have to talk to her. Wait a minute. She's definitely my wife, so I don't know how she can be your wife. That doesn't add up, man. No, Shauna looks nothing like my wife. My my wife actually looks more like Arrow. Arrow Marvel Snap. My wife is Arrow, dude. He's honestly somewhat true. All right, were you just sleeping on the couch tonight? No, my wife told me to put more sexy ladies in my YouTube thumbnails to get more views. She literally said that this week. I uh, I told her how I put uh, this Jubilee. Uh. Where is that video? I learned a lot about you guys this week because I, I need to play the game. Hold up, I need to concentrate here. Okay. 
I changed this YouTube thumbnail. Avengers! Assemble. Here, I'll show you in a second. This one right here. It just... Where did it... It just... Oh my god, it just... It just moved everything. This one. It used to be different. I put this Jubilee in the thumbnail and the views skyrocketed. It used to have like scorpion or something i don't remember who some generic character i put that jubilee in the thumbnail and and the views literally tripled you guys are despicable is the moral of the story we need to play shauna now actually I'm gonna get full locations though so dr doom's gonna be really bad this strange academy is kind of wrecking me actually it's okay though Shauna gets Korg, Sunspot, and Mantis. All right, that's cool. The, 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 the views literally skyrocketed. Like tripled. It was getting like 20 views an hour and it went up to like 60 views an hour off that thumbnail alone. I was like, are you guys kidding me? Shame on all of you. All right, we are just oh that is like the perfect draw actually. Yeah, adding power everywhere is really nice Shauna looking pretty good here, dude, really she's gonna contribute a lot of power to this board. This is the first game I've been pretty pumped about Shauna I don't know if we're gonna win but legit pretty excited about Shauna Zabu makes them pretty threatening. Of course three four drops is a lot of power potentially Hey, Delarock, thanks for the prime sub, dude. Rude wife, best life. Yes. Yes. Typhoid Mary. Yep, that's big. That is just big enough, isn't it? Oh, oh, oh! Wait, what? It's not just big enough. Oh my god, the lizard got, the ant man got countered by the lizard. What? Tie tie seven. What on earth? Great Shauna game, honestly. Really nice. Gonna get fired. My boss is gonna fire me. He's a total jerk. He makes me work every day. Total jerk that guy is, my boss. Handsome though. My god, he's handsome. He's strikingly good looking. His beautiful red beard. Rotund face. My god, is he handsome. My god, he's handsome. Let's lock this game down right. We can play with Shauna and Doom potentially as well, so let's create some lockdown here. Ooh, Maximus. Oh, even more bonus stats. Oh, <laughs> I was all excited, but not anymore. Um, yeah, I think Kazar is actually going to be a little better than Jessica Jones. I'm just thinking about board space. Like Shauna's going to put two cards in, and then I got space for one more card here. But I might even want to play Dr. Doom as well, depending on the draw. Because we only have three cards in deck, right? So, um, but for now, yeah, let's just get that Kazar there. I think they're more likely to play mid than anywhere else. So, okay, yeah. Fisca Jones would have been the same size, it turns out. Okay, so honestly, we're... Oh, that is so good for the Shauna on the final turn, right? We're probably always losing right, but this just makes us really strong in the other two spots. Uh, we're honestly still pretty good the the armor doing a lot of work there right yeah ant-man's good too okay yeah this is as good a shot as we're gonna get i think we should expect a silver surfer so we're expecting this to go to six and 12 but we expect to beat six and 12 because of the shauna here adding a ton of extra stats oh evident oh i wish these had been flipped but still good Titania is awesome. Oh my god. Are we gonna win right? Holy crap. No, but we got big 
yeah, that's uh, it's perfect, Shauna. Absolutely perfect Free game, Shauna. We love you, Shauna. You're the best. The Null Galactus title is really dirty in Norwegian. Oh, I know. <laughs> and you telling me, all of you tell me in the YouTube comments how dirty it is, and boy oh boy does YouTube love all the extra comments. <laughs> it gets a lot of extra views because of all of you commenting to tell me that it's dirty. Do you think it's a coincidence that I called the video, I want to Null Galactus all the time? <laughs> <laughs> it's not even a really a sentence structure that makes much sense in English, but I just I knew it was gonna I knew it was gonna go well for you guys. So, what does it mean? Uh, it it basically is the uh, the F word, if you will. So if I if I want to null Galactus, what do I want to do to Galactus? That's the question. Do the deed, yes, there you go. So I've been I've been enjoying I have been enjoying the Null decks in particular from a titling standpoint. Wow, Patriot, of course, and their shocker deck is so great for debris. That's annoying. Um Doctor Doom adds a ton of power. I'm wondering if I actually just do this. Like we don't really need to contest kill that hard if I'm going Doctor Doom. Uh, where am I putting Kazar then, though? Nowhere? It's probably just worth less. I don't actually think we beat Patriot, but I'm curious to try this, uh, this Kamertage Doctor Doom, see if it can win. Like, literally just skip turn five. I don't think it can win, but... Because Shocker's already too big, right? It's gonna be seven. Eh. We'll see. Yes, you guys are learning. I'm, I'm learning a lot about sexing up my YouTube videos, this in, in Marvel Snap in particular. You guys just want Jubilee and thumbnails and Arrow and thumbnails. You want me to make dirty puns in the titles. It's like, time. That's uh That's all I do now. I mean if they're playing Ultron here, do we win what do they got? Uh plus five per per Ultron. No, we don't I mean each one's five, it's twenty power. No, we lose. Maybe they don't have it though, who knows? Let's have some fun. They I'm sure they do, but maybe they don't. Who knows? They do. They always have it, don't they? Oh wait, did we ever win on ties? I didn't even think about winning on the tie. <laughs> Unreal. Yeah, I, I don't know if I can, <laughs> on this note, yeah. I don't know if I can do a Null Shauna deck. I uh, mean, <laughs> you guys might explode if I put Null and Shauna in the same deck and put it in the title. I I I I don't I don't think YouTube can handle that. <laughs> you guys would have a meltdown. You you'd click the video too much. You you'd you'd, uh, you'd melt YouTube servers if I said I I'm going to Null Shauna in this video. <laughs> People it's, it's just too much for you. I know it. YouTube, YouTube sees enormous increase in ad revenue. Biggest company in the world. One video attributed to the success. God, you're telling me Shauna now is another another dirty word in a different language. My God, guys. Um. No, I'm losing, right? I can't. I'm losing. I can't. I mean, I would win with Ant-Man probably, but I would lose here and here, so I can't do that. I think I'm fine to play Debris still, though. Blue Marvel uh, Bar Sinister is probably going to be worth it for us. So, like, maybe Jessica Jones mid 
Theodore left, and then Blue Marvel. Oh yeah, they're. Oh my God, I better get something decent. Oh. Oh, is Jessica Jones big enough though? Cause she's gonna add six, 10, 12 actually. Yes, she is big enough. And then Blue Marvel and Kazar will add even more plus Ant-Man. So yeah, actually this is fine. Assuming we think we're winning the other two locations, honestly, this game looks pretty squared away. I mean, they really only have three spots left to play. How much power can they really add here? Can't be that much, right? Oh, Moon Girl kind of scary. That's making me think Devil Dino, right? Can I win mid? Oh, what's going mid? Is that Devil Dino already? It's not going right? I thought that would go right. Oh, I guess they have two maybe though, don't they? But going mid means I, yeah, okay. So I do have a very fixed target here, uh, numerically speaking, which this adds nine power and this adds some amount more. It's enough. Plus you assume the dino is going to get a little smaller sometimes. He can't get bigger. So yeah, this is fine. This is, this is a lock. Unless something surprising happens, a uh, killmonger, I guess, sort of thing. Uh, is even killmonger enough? I don't, I don't think so. It only lose. 14 uh we uh we, yeah we'd only lose 14 loud i don't think killmonger's enough yeah it's a lot cool. Victory. yeah this deck's a good zoo deck guys yeah that was definitely one for youtube by the way are we undefeated with this deck or am i crazy <laughs> am i uh am i wrong oh no we're six and one though my god we're up 11 cubes six and one this is going great so far. This feels really, really good. You're on a green screen? Yeah. I'm faking my background. Because I'm too lazy. Uh... <gasps> too lazy to move my green screen every day between marvel snap and hearthstone hearthstone i don't like a background here i do i'm uh, i'm actually gonna get a bunch of my marvel toys out of my uh out of my basement i have a ton of marvel uh marvel action figures and stuff i the, the background right now is like all blizzard hearthstone because that's all i ever played but now that i got marvel in the mix i'm gonna add some marvel stuff to my backdrop and take a new photo for the Marvel version of this backdrop. Like right now it's like Ragnaros and you can't really see it's blurry, but you know, you can kind of tell it's not Marvel anyway. But I got some big awesome figures and sure some other stuff I'll find. Marvel Legends. Yeah, some Marvel Legends. Uh, some stuff from uh, like Diamond Direct and like... Uh, Wind aid my uh, hand. What else do I have? I gotta, I gotta think about my mar various Marvel items. Not even sure anymore, but yeah, a bunch of bunch of legends. I used to be an action figure influencer before that was a thing. Before I was a video game influencer. Whatever that means. <laughs> it's so stupid, but you know what I mean. All right. Am I the only one that's been enjoying Marvel Snap way more than Hearthstone? You are not. I enjoy Marvel Snap more than Hearthstone gameplay wise right now. And honestly have for a little while. It's kind of a pain. Killing my space, bro. Clear for takeoff. Need blue Marvel here. Eh, Kazar is probably the next best bet. Are we better off playing Debris? No, I think I need the power here. They're going to have to commit power here, so. 
Oh man, Gamora must be nice to have in this scenario. Jeez. Can I get Blue Marble? Shauna, okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah, let's see. I don't know, makes us pretty big. It means I beat Sunspot, number one, and they have to contest pretty hard here. I mean, we're adding on average six to eight power, eight with Kzar, six naturally, and maybe more if we high roll something. Titania could be cool. Uh, we are revealing first, so maybe not Titania, I guess, but... Do the changes to duels make it feel better today? Uh, yeah, we had a good duels run. Yeah, that's fine. We didn't run into anything too much that felt uh, annoying. What's my favorite franchise in general? Star Wars, Marvel, etc. Uh, I don't know. I'd have to think about that. Eight power indeed. Oh, moving the Deadpool back over. Okay. Mojo, almost good enough. Oh, dude. Look at this. Again, Shauna. Actually insane. Shauna's just winning games and got the, uh, the emoji too. Thank you, Shauna. Favorite franchise. I mean, Warcraft is definitely up there regardless. I, I, I think Warcraft has to be near the top. Mad, no, Mad Max is okay. Not Final Fantasy. I mean, I used to enjoy Final Fantasy, but not, I can't say I've played Final Fantasy in forever. I don't know. I like Transformers pretty well, but I can't say it's the top. I hate Harry Potter. I I've never been into Harry Potter. My wife loves Harry Potter, but I just find it so boring. I like the first two Harry Potter movies and that's it. I'm just not a Harry Potter guy. I think fighting with wands when looks so silly. No, oh, boo, 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 I got a wand. Poo, poo. It's so stupid to me. <laughs> I just hate the wand fighting. <laughs> anyway. Poo, poo, I got a wand. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z, by the way, is probably up there. Uh, Dragon Ball's, uh, I'd say, top three or four for me. Star Wars is probably up there, historically. I don't know, not as much lately, maybe, but... Probably Warcraft, Dragon Ball, Star Wars... Yeah, lightsabers versus wands is not even close, right? How much cooler are freaking lightsabers than wands? Come on. They're so cool. I don't know that we can beat Cerebro here. We can try. Now we can't even disrupt a. Uh... Can't even disrupt Mystique here. Seems like no Mystique. Wait, what does Wong do in this deck? Wait, what does Wong do? Why am I not thinking about what Wong does? What's he play for with Wong for two? It's not Brood, it's not. The Iceman, Scorpion. That's too late though. What's the what's the two power wall? Oh, Hazmat. Oh. They have Luke Cage. Theoretically more power off Shauna because of Kazar, right? Can't play this anywhere else. Victory. It's just a two. Surely there's a better, cheaper two though. They retreated? What in God's name was in hand? I think Shauna probably would have won left if they didn't add any additional power here because no Mystique. So Shauna probably wins left because between Kzar and Blue Marvel, you're usually getting like four power. And we're winning right in that case too because we're going to get another four there on average. So maybe we were favored, but... It's okay, they would have timed all left and lost. Dude, why is it true though that that movement deck every time I've played a movement deck, they just believe the Heimdall's magically gonna make them win. Maybe, maybe it is because they're bots. I don't know. But I've had so many instances like that where it, it, it's like they just trust that they're gonna win somehow off the Heimdall. Like it's just suddenly it's magically gonna just add 20 power and everything's gonna sort itself out. It's like they don't count. They just throw their hands up and say, yeah, Heimdall, you're great Heimdall. All right, Shauna, go get him. Go get him, Shauna. Oh, Titania would be nice here. You did it backwards. 
That's the wrong way. <laughs> a negative one symbiote. You idiot. <laughs> like, what are you doing, you idiot? Uh, all right. What am I playing next turn? Oh. Titania, do I want to try to snipe that the final turn? Are they going to play a card there? God only knows, but I think we're losing, right? Either way. I don't know. I'm trying to keep my options open, but I just, uh, I think we're screwed. Heimdall takes the wheel. Yes, that's exactly right. That's exactly right. Oh, I have a zero. Yeah, you're right. I didn't even see it. Yeah. Oh, wait. Why did it work? Oh, no, no. Cosmo, Cosmo. We're fine. No, we're fine. I knew I should trust myself. Knew I should trust you, Twitch chat. Yeah, hard to know if Titania is going to be right or not, but uh, mm, do we want to put Demon here since we're filling Mojo anyway? We probably don't really need the power to contest Mojo so much as the body, so Debris is kind of fine, right? Yeah, I think I like this better. Now maybe we take right because Titania is a huge risk left. I'm I'm actually revealing first, but that's okay because they're playing anyway. Well, it depends on how many they play, but might be fine to flip it back. I think we got a good shot here, honestly. One card right is it idiot leader again? I mean, Titania flipped, so that's kind of sad. Oh, Magneto. It's enough anyway. Dang, dude. That's sad. Bart! What was their title? Does it show here? I don't see it. <laughs> I'm gonna say, what just happened <laughs> to Fart? <laughs> What was that? What happened? Don't trust your opponent. Yeah, nev never trust him. Titania betrayed us and now Fart will betray us as well. Uh... I knew we were keeping this hand. I'd probably play Debris, but I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna have Kzar. Like, ooh, Zabu's gonna be bad. Jessica Jones is chill. Power here is pretty low, though. Uh, Kazar came back. Man, they got really big there. Shoot. So we're gonna go to 11 left, and then Dr. Doom pushes that to 16. Maybe they'll think they're done contesting uh, left, although that seems very unlikely. Taskmaster can't go... Can't go right. So Taskmaster would go left. Then I lose to Taskmaster left. Because Dr. Doom's not big enough. It's 16 to 30. Can't beat Red Skull mid, can I? Like if I go Shauna or something and just try to. Like if I hit uh, Ebony Maul, I get 9 and 4 is only 13. If I had to play with Shauna, that might be a possible. Oh, but then you have Kazar. So it would be 15 if I hit Ebony Maw. Listen, we have nothing at risk. Let's let's go for the God tier. Let's go. Wait, that's still only, oh no, four and, and uh, no, it's four and 10. That's only 14. That's still not enough. No, Ebony Maw's not enough. 
Anyway, I just want to see what they have. I don't care. I just want to see. We're going to lose, but it's fun. Ah, uh, She-Hulk is a Taskmaster. Same story for us, though. Mbaku, dude. How fun. Yeah, the fart got us, man. You want Iceman down earlier rather than later. Save Ant-Man for later. Scorpion's good. Cosmo's good. Debris is good. DC is going to buff the debris card for both me and the opponent. Not sure if that's good or bad. Dude, this is going to get locked up real quick. Which I think is good for us, right? We like that better because we have Kzar to buff all this garbage. As long as they're not like a Patriot deck. Lizard should be fine. Uh, yeah, let's really lock this down, right? <laughs> uh, yeah. Next turn, we can go Kazar Ant-Man, probably. Maybe Blue Marvel. I think Ant-Man did. Just to get this buff right. Ooh, Cosmo could have disrupted that, but he didn't. Okay. Surely we scale off this better, right? What is that gonna be? Oh, all systems oh. go. Well, that's pretty spicy. Blue Marvel? Oh. Eh, we better off with a Cosmo here just to prevent any shenanigans, maybe. Don't really think the two power is going to matter, but the Cosmo could change a lot, right? Victory. So, yeah, Spectrum's a good example. And have some nuance. What do you use for the deck that makes you show what has been drawn? It's it's the deck tracker from untapped.gg. Enough said, bub. Okay. Kazar still uh, we're getting in these scenarios a lot where it's like pretty clear that blue marvel doctor doom is always the line post kazar and that just feels worse maybe maybe it's actually still shauna because we get to fill up locations right iceman stranded in this case maybe we're better off going here for both the surprise value and the uh we gotta play Doctor Doom. Well, he can still go mid, yeah. Shauna will fill here, here, mid. Mid or left, whatever is fine. But we're, we're never big enough, right? We're just never big enough. I don't think. I mean, let, let's see. I, I don't think we're big enough, though. We're losing mid for sure. Unless we hit like Ebony Maw or something insane. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm curious. Again, we're, 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 no, we're no risk here. We'll eat some cubes. Chavez is big. Ebony Maul could win this, man. <laughs> Ebony Maul! Nova, are we big enough right? No, we're not big enough right. Dang it, dude. So close. He did one Ebony Maw. Any, either of these spots would have been enough. This is a perfect little lockdown hand. Uh, uh, 
No, I can't debris, right? There's no way. It's never correct. It's never correct. <laughs> uh, no. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't do it. We gotta storm it. It's fine. Storm will win. Wind, aid my hand. Viper. Look at me, guys. I'm freaking Nostradamus out here, man. You see that call? Genius calls. What's this play gonna be? This is gonna be a uh, uh, Sandman. That's Sam, man. He's green and he's a 4 1. The, the graphic just loaded weird, okay? But that's totally Sandman. By God, if the opponent plays any disruption, I literally can't. I, I gotta get a card. Opponent I gotta get Dr. Doom or Shauna. But if they play anything like a, it can't be a ho it can't be a hobgoblin because they'll go right back to their side. But anything that disrupts here screws me. Oh god, is that gonna be like a white tiger? Are you kidding, game? How do I not freaking hit either of my wide board cards in this game? Well, good game again. Great loss again, man. Love that white tiger you got there. Dr. Doom, maybe. Oh, hazmat. That's fun. Victory. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> this is another one of those hazmat take the wheels and you just don't even count it out or anything. Cause I did not add much power. I only added six power. <laughs> they just, they just were like, nah, whatever. <laughs> It'll work, right? I've done that. Yeah, just throw it, send it. It'll be fine. Send it. Space throne. Okay, that could be a, debris could be a great equalizer there. So that we have like a blue marvel buff. That's, that's, that's fun. It just loses the game. You can't. Because like, they'll always beat you in Bar Sinister. You can't. You can't do it. <laughs> it's like always tempting, though. You're always just like, well, wait a minute here. Wait a minute. What if I did, though? What if I did, though? <sighs> Shauna worth it here? I really want to get as many blue marbles there as I can. I'm kind of digging the storm. Then what am I... What am I, what am I playing? Cosmo Ant-Man or something? I like shutting the game down though, because it feels like they're going to want to do stuff. I don't know what they're going to want to do, Mr. Negative or something. But if I shut the game down, I limit their ability to do crazy stuff. Sarah on four, huh? Hmm. Makes me a little more nervous. Uh... Am I revealing first? No, that's annoying. Oh, shoot. Dang, I wish I'd revealed first. So annoying. I mean, the, the, I guess the good news is... They're kind of out of plays. They don't have like a hobgoblin play, do they? Like we wait a turn, in other words. See who has the better turn six. Rude. Okay, so that's absolutely a silver surfer play. They wanted to put a three in to buff it to win this spot. 
that's gonna add nine power they're going to 19. i'm only adding oh no i add way more than a silver surfer adds i'm adding three i'm adding 12. So this should be fine if that's what it is. Wong Surfer, I would just own this lane, so that'd be fine. And I win mid too, so either way, I mean, honestly, with Surfer, I just win. I win these two, so it doesn't even matter, right? They don't. They don't win the, the right or, or or mid, so. Ironheart. I could win the rock. I don't think it ever wins left. Oh my god. Oh, the, the rock didn't get hit one time. I guess they only had they only had six buffs. It's not that crazy, but yeah, were they better off just going surfer? I wonder three times. I guess they really wanted to hit the rock. But probably not. Yeah, that's fine. Good win. Is she winning games? I'm scared to ask. Well, I'll tell you, we started out in eight and one with this deck on the back of Shauna. Eight and one. That's how we started. Since then, <laughs> we've gone three and 11. So we're almost dead even at the end of all that. But uh, she hasn't been terrible by any means. I think we, uh, one could argue going 50-50 with a kind of new deck is not a terrible result. I'm not sure it's the best argument, but one could argue that. This inky sunspot here is cool. Wind Black uh, flare thingy hand. too is nice, man. That's my storm. Thank you. Ooh, the combo on six. Let's go. Shuri, I wonder if they have anything good in hand since we know we have their red skull and their armor. Oh my God, the Taskmaster too. Uh, oh dude, the Hulk Taskmaster is fun as well. I, I think we just go red skull straight up though. He should be big enough. Uh, and then just Taskmaster zero next turn is fine. I don't see how they win from here. This would be a snap. Normally, if you're snapping, I'm not snapping. I, I want to see the game end, but... Oh, dang, that's big. Okay. Bigger than I expected, actually. Oh, hit the Taskmaster. We lose the three on the arrow here, or the zero here. Um, I wonder if we ever just meme. I'm a little bit worried about Dr. Doom though, man. You guys worried about Dr. Doom at all? Cause it beats flood. I guess it doesn't beat right though. If I go like taskmaster, right. And it we would lose mid, but we'd win left and right on the Dr. Doom. Same for Shauna. I actually like it this way. I think this is fine. So it's like, yeah, take mid, but we win the other two. Yeah. Perfect. Victory. Cool. God, this still barely won, by the way. <laughs> 